One of the things I think in hockey is that there is great, there's a lot of great teams, and it's not, a, there's not a, it's hard for even the, the media, the smart media, to come up with who's going to win the Stanley Cup at the beginning of the year. And so, you know, to predict that the Detroit Red Wings are going to win it again is very difficult to do, even though they have a good team. There's lots of good hockey teams, and really, we know that, you know, the 16 teams that are left still have, still have a pretty decent chance to get on the roll and, and be there at the end. So I think it's harder due to the quality of teams, the quality of players in the league than, than maybe it was um, previously. Uh, so that's why it's, I think it's hard. But I don't think it has a lot to do with uh, being tired or having a short off season. Um, these guys are in great shape. I think one of the things you'll find in uh, elite athletes and especially guys that have been in their career for a long time is they're their mental game is is experienced. They know their game, and while you're out, you can still be involved in the game mentally. You can still watch the game from what you would do, and when you're training, you put that into your training as well. This is how I would play. This is what I would do. This is me on the power play, and so you can get some of that sharpness in your game even while you're sitting out. So I'm not surprised totally that an experienced guy like Bonchar was able to step back in and do that. But what he brings. Uh, he brings experience. I think the well, it's a game of mistakes. I will. It's even uh, more so in the playoffs. How we played everything is uh, special teams is huge. Um, you know, they look at all the many special teams uh, mistakes. Those things about the fact that you can make a lot of things. So when you look at it, what's you kind of found a little bit of consistency the last month or so on the power play. What's what's the biggest difference? I mean, there were times early in the year. You go through games where if you didn't score, well, you struggled to to have good shifts with it. But at least even games you're not scoring now, you're yeah. having good. I think it's been our focus. We always do things right and give ourselves a chance to be successful there. If not, we want to make sure we get momentum from that. So um, we've done a better job of that. And probably our work ethic uh, it starts there. Um, we have a lot of skill. It's easy to kind of rely on, on that for a little bit, but. Uh, We've got our work ethic there first, and now let the skill take over after that. And if we don't score, we want to make sure that uh, we have a positive impact with the momentum. It's a 60 minute game, it's an 80 game, 82 game se season, it's a seven game series. You don't have to win the game in one, one play, you don't have to do it in one power play. And there's a calmness to doing things the right way.